Today's event was bringing together business community to make sure that they're on top of their HR, that they know where to go to for advice with keeping up to date with employment contracts, but also probably look at their staffing and learn how to treat the employees, you know, what is going to attract them. So more than just the contract, how we can encourage them, how we can grow our own businesses and getting tips that we probably wouldn't have normally thought about. Today, probably the surveys was a little bit reflective of getting that from them as well, is getting their opinion and their voice, because without their voice, we don't know what we're doing all the time. So we won't be able to go and create better resources. So from today as an outcome on a high level is taking all the feedback that they actually reported from today, which we'll get, um, and learning what resources we need to get on top of and what have we missed. My highlight was businesses coming back and respond that they got value out of it and that they were going to take some of that away and implement it and hopefully we can help some people grow. We receive a lot of phone calls, emails from businesses that are struggling with the attraction and retention. Really trying to find the right people to fill the roles is the hardest thing right now businesses are saying and then how to actually encourage a workplace culture that works for the business, works for the employees that they're finding and attracting into the business so that it's a good long-term sustainable outcome for everybody involved. What we're hoping is that we broaden the business community's horizons to some different creative ideas and solutions that they could be looking at implementing, start to question their internal practices, their workforce planning. The highlight for me would be seeing the businesses engaging. So through things like our Slido activities and being able to get real time actual feedback from the businesses about what they're wanting, what they're needing, what their current challenges are. And then the other aspect is providing useful resources to the businesses. I think across all of what we do as an RJC, it's about connecting people. There is so much that exists out there that is just hard to find out that it even exists. So really what we as an RJC are about is bringing bits of the puzzle together putting it into resources and effectively joining the dots. I think the small businesses get exposure to a lot of big players out there by coming to events like this. They get to hear what's happening in the, from a wider audience versus just being in the Redlands. So they get expertise coming into the Redlands that actually benefit their business. I do find with small businesses what helps is connecting with other small business owners and understanding what their troubles are but also how they're dealing with them because you can bring that information back into your own workforce. So as much as this event is an amazing education piece and an amazing opportunity to learn about it, the connections that small businesses can make through events like this can actually help them run their own business and not feel so alone in compliance and, and recruitment and training and all of that in the community. There's so many people in there keen, yearning for that advice in recruitment and HR and just needing that support and that the support is out there. Along that analogy of how much time do you spend working on the business versus in the business. So I think even though you think you're too busy to attend an event like this or what it might bring to your day, take the time, carve the time out. You'll always take away one thing and you might meet a person that can make a difference to your business. It was a really great panel of experts freely sharing their knowledge and that open questions at the end was really helpful. Uh, we got lots of homework, so there's lots of courses available to us that are free and also just knowing as an employer that there are all of these resources, both paid and unpaid, that I can draw upon to help me in running my business safely. I think community is the big bit. Being able to speak with everyone. You can just reach around, brainstorm ideas, and it potentially solves problems before they even come up if you're not aware of them because everyone has their own experiences. And I think using that feedback helps a lot for everyone.